So today we are calculating our line solution. So this time we are using the scale. This scale can only take up to 10 kg. Yes, it will take up to 10 kg. So we are using the scale, we are also using hydrometer. I want you all to get the point clear. That's why I'm trying to do all of them at the same time. This is the caustic soda, the light caustic soda some of you all have been asking me what is caustic soda what is light solution the light solution is just a mixture of the uh, light or the caustic soda with water okay so that's just it so we'll try and gauge it right now we'll try and calculate the light solution for making bar soaps okay this is the water i have here I have about five liters of water right here. Five liters of water. So let's uh, measure one kg of caustic soda and pour it into the water and use the hydrometer on it. And let's see if it's the light, the caustic soda will be much in it or less for making the bar soap. Okay, so let's measure our our caustic soda so we want one kg we'll be dissolving one kg This one right here is more than one kg. It's more than one kg, so I'm going to remove some from it. Let me remove this. Exactly, we've gotten our one kg. Okay, thousand grams. That's it over there. So now let's add our thousand grams, one kg of caustic soda into five liters of water. So after mixing it with the water, then we will use the hydrometer to gauge it and see if it will be there will be more caustic soda in it or that that is okay for bar soap making or it is less so let's get into it i hope you all are getting it clear okay so let's pour it into our water so you have to stir it thoroughly Make sure if you are working with light, you wear your nose marks, your hand gloves. Do it in an airy place. Don't do it indoor because it is not safe to inhale all these fuse out there. At this time, it is so hot, very, very hot, very, very hot. So you have to be careful about it. So you make sure that you stay it, everything has dissolved in it properly even if you protect yourself enough don't do it indoors do it outdoor because you will still inhale it even if you wear those marks or whatever and it's not good for the system so we have dissolved it now we'll use the hydrometer so this is the hydrometer 
it has three calibration that's a red white at the middle and green at the last so the road recharge on the red the road um the road fair on the on the white and the road good on the green so that means if you put your hydrometer into this light solution and it floats and it's on the red button that means the light solution in the water is so low and cannot make your soap it will make your soap a baby very soft and it cannot even hold and the white one okay that one is fair it's fair if you you are making your your bathing soap baby soap and all of those things it can be on the white but that one too has the gauge it has thousand because of the gun thousand two hundred and twenty five or also has thousand two hundred and fifty so the green button that one if you are making bath so you want hard bath soap for washing and all, all of those things then you can place it on the green it can be thousand two hundred and seventy five yes and if you place it on 1,300, that's going to be a very hard, 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 hard uh, caustic soda in your life. So let's let's go into it. We we are looking it. We are looking at it being on 1,275. That's on the green button the first reading i hope you all are getting it so let's dip it inside our light solution right now and see where it will be okay have you seen what is going on here it is on recharge that means the caustic soda in this uh, water is too low and it cannot make soap so we we'll have to top up with caustic soda so let's get into it again so let's measure another caustic soda with the kg first with the kilo first i'm sure this time let's let's get 500 grams okay so this one here is 502 but it's fine it's fine so let's top it up okay so let's add it and mix it again very well so the first one showed that the light solution is too small in this water and it cannot hold your soap. It cannot make your soap foam. You can it will make your soap watery and all of those things. So you top up with caustic soda. back all over as you can see it is getting better it is getting better i don't know the foaming that's coming on top it's getting better let me remove the foam from the top and reinsert it back The second batch, the second 500 grams costly soda we added is not enough. We'll measure another one again. First, give this 
this one five uh, six hundred. Yes, that's it. Six hundred. So let's add it again. So let's insert it again. Okay. Look at that. It has to settle. Alright, so we've got it guys. This is it. It's on the the green button. That means we have enough uh, measurement of water and caustic soda mixed together to make your bar soap. So I'm just going to cover this light solution down and be using it anytime I want to make soap. I'll just fetch it and make soap. So you can just do it like that. So as you can see, it's on the thousand. thousand 275 and that's what we are looking for a stable it's very stable that's it so that's how you can make your life solution down just cover it up and keep using it as long as i want just keep it tight all right <laughs>